Hey everyone, I hope you're all enjoying 2023. Today I've got six fantastic American muscle cars, all vintage racers that you can add to your collection. All the links are in the description. All of these mods are free and they're ready to download now. Remember, if you're looking for Assetto Corsa mods, you're in the right place. Check out all the other hundreds of Assetto Corsa videos on the channel. And if you like what you see, I'd love to have you on board. So do click on that subscribe button. We are jumping straight into the first mod then. We are not messing about today. At number one, we have the Mustang Mach 1 by Joshua Widder. Now this is at version 0.92. With this come a number of different cars though. It is a pack, you get the Boss 302, the 429, the 302R and the 429R. They range from 346 horsepower all the way up to 537. These cars have brilliant handling. There's been some updates on tires, brakes, wheels. There's many, many details on this, as you can see on the interior and the exterior. And I do really love things like that stereo dial missing, really cool stuff. This works great with the latest version of CSP. And if you've not got this car and you love your American muscle cars, this is absolutely essential. This is the Mustang Mach 1. <laughs> Following very quickly on its heels is this AMC Javelin again by Joshua Widder. This is a version 0.5A. Both the previous Mustang Mach 1 and this AMC Javelin come from around 1970. Now this car has a number of different variations with it as well, including a Trans Am edition. They range from 305 to 350 brake horsepower. There is 18 skins with this car as well, so some brilliant colors, including this gorgeous Trans Am paint job that I've got on now. This car weighs about 1400 kilograms, so they're not light. And these cars are great in a straight line, but they're a brilliant car also to have some very tight races. As with the previous car, the Mustang, you can see Joshua's attention to detail. And again, these cars have been out for a little while now, but they still stack up really well with a lot of the new modern mods. So again, another car to grab and add to your American muscle collection. Next up and at number three, we have this Yenko Stinger. So this is actually a Chevrolet Corvair Corsair, and this is by Stereo. This car was actually modified by Don Yenko and it took part in a number of SCC events in the middle of the 60s. Now it's a 2.8 litre flat six and it pulls about 180 brake horsepower. It weighs 1200 kilograms, so you're not gonna set any lap records against modern cars, but these cars are all about the vintage element and the fun. Benno Bro and Aphid God also help with this mod and included in this mod, and I've not shown it here, but I'll let you explore it yourself. There is a great fun car, a different kind of skin, and you will know it when you see it. It's really good stuff. So this is the Yenko Stinger by Stereo. And now for something completely different. You know with my videos, I like to chuck in something that's really fun. And at number four, we have this Dodge Chally Wally. This is by Tanari. So what is it? Well, it's very different. This is effectively a mini Dodge Challenger. It weighs 600 kilograms and it's got 157 brake horsepower from a one liter motorbike engine. So you're probably saying, well, what's that got to do with American Muscle? Well, there is another version of this that comes in the pack that will probably make it onto the thumbnail, and that has got a whopping 427 brake horsepower, including a huge supercharger. So this car is absolutely great fun. Again, if you wanted something to play about with, with your friends on online races, this is one of the cars. Next up, we're at number five, and this is the AC289 Sport. Now this is by Old Rebel, but the original mod was made by Mecco and Panky Campus. Again, there are a number of cars in this pack. They range from 271 brake horsepower to 390 brake horsepower. Do remember with this car though, you do need to install it in slightly different ways, so do check on the instructions. All of the links to all of these mods are numbered in the description, so do check those out below. And all of these mods, just to say again, are absolutely free. Now this car is an American classic, and the amount of detail that is on this car is phenomenal. It looks absolutely beautiful on a set of Corsa.
And lastly on the list and at number six, I love this mod. This is probably my favorite out of all of the mods today. This is the Chinook Mark II by Stereo and it's at version one. So this car is a Canadian car that was raced in the Can-Am Series Group 7. It's got a small block Chevy in it, 376 brake horsepower. This car raced against absolute legend brands like McLaren and Lola. So if you are wanting to put together a race with all of these iconic 60s brands, you can stick this car in there and it will be very, very in place. You'd need to drive this car carefully. It doesn't go around corners very well. And actually Stereo states that very clearly in the description for this mod. It's absolutely beautifully detailed though. It's a lovely car to look at. The interior looks great, if not a very, very scary place to be if you're going fast. And you really do need to take your hats off to the drivers that were racing in all of these series events in the 60s and 70s because they were very, very brave people. There we have it then, six amazing mods to add to your collection. And remember all the variations of cars you've actually got in those packs too. Thank you so much for watching. As ever, do check out the rest of the channel, whether you're looking for mods, guides, or tutorials on a set of course, so you're absolutely in the right place. I will see you guys very soon.